I'm not saying I have a huge channel because I don't. I'm just a small potato in a pot of stew. You know, I'm here in this YouTube community, but I said, fuck it, I have a voice, I have a platform. And I, you know, and, I'm, and this right here is in this, this serious tone. This ain't no fan, but it's, it's a, I think we all need to make aware of what Nintendo is doing, okay? Before I start that video, it's been a room much floating around also that uh, maybe Microsoft, maybe taking the Xbox, taking, sorry, taking the Kinect out of the Xbox One. Uh, remember they said before that you had to have the Kinect for the Xbox One to work, but I don't know if from an update, this may not be the case, or they may be looking to sell the Xbox One for $300. If they do that shit, whoa. Also, there's another article, this is true. If you don't, you know, the PlayStation 4 is uh, like the Xbox One now is reaching lock. Even if the system doesn't launch, launch in your country, you can probably import it from PlayAsia, different websites and stuff like that. But if whatever country you're living in with the PlayStation 4, if you don't have access to the PlayStation Store, you will not be able to play any online multiplayer games. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know, like I said, uh, that's never affected me, you know, anybody I know, but, you know, so maybe be looking to import a PlayStation 4 and pay that heavily, you know, fee. Most people want to play online multiplayer, you know, so maybe you want to wait before you do that. Also, um, that's it. I'm going to go on today's, today's uh, story. Um, wow, this is crazy in this day and age. Now, this is crazy in this day and age. Um, and like I said, this is some real shit that we all should be aware of. It says, Walk Free has launched a video lampooning Nintendo's characters Mario and Luigi, which states that Nintendo has yet to respond to a forceful campaign to join an electronics industry and an audit program for conflict free mineral supplies. If you guys know what conflict means, you maybe heard of um, conflict diamonds, or, you know, blood diamonds they call them, where they have, they force child labor and, you know, these militants go into these villages and snatch these children out of bed or an adult, make mine these, di I'm sorry, these, you know, caves and stuff for minerals, you know, and, and diamonds, but this, this is not about diamonds, but it's the same damn thing, you know, chopping up arms and they just fucked up shit. Um, it says conflict-free minerals. The video points out that minerals sourced from some suppliers come from slavery operations in the conflict region, including the Democratic Republic of Congo, while in Africa, where miners are often forced to work at gunpoint. Um, so the Walk Free website states that the campaign aims to tell the team that slavery is not a game and asks that we sent over 430,000 emails, let's say actually 435 to 58 emails, calling on Nintendo to take concrete steps to ensure slave mine conflict minerals are not, <laughs> wow, are not in its gaming consoles. Wow, and we have heard nothing back. So basically, Nintendo can't say that we only think about it. This company has reached out to them and sent them over 400,000 goddamn emails. Like, hey, a lot of times companies don't know what, you know, what, you know, what's going on in these different countries. Like Nike at one time was having, you know, not Nike, but it was having underage kids, I think China or whatever the fuck they were, were making these Nike Air Jordan sneakers. And, you know, and the same thing with Hanes. They didn't know once they found out, made it public, they stopped using them and doing it. You know what I mean? But Nintendo, like I said, they're still... Doing it, and they said this company can't say they don't know this company sent over 400,000 emails to them. It says elect electronic devices like game consoles makes use of minerals such as tin, titanium, uh, to justice and gold, often sourced from conflict zones. Government troops and militants fight for control of the mines, <laughs> states walk free. They often terrorize communities using forced labor, death, bondage, sexual slavery, goddamn, the use of children by armed groups and others, child slavery. Child slaves are often used for the worst types of labor, such as diggers in the mines or supporters assist in transport of conflict minerals. As a protest today is being planned to decide with Nintendo's annual Green General Meeting on June 27, supporters are encouraged to collapse now. This is crazy. This is this is the just what said. It illustrates me. illustrates that Nintendo ranked dead last among 24 major, major consumer electronic companies on average to examine the end of conflict minerals. So now God damn, and all these big corporate places in the world and you know, Toshiba, Samsung, all that shit like that. Nintendo came in dead last place. Like, this is some crazy shit. This is not a joking manner. Like, these motherfuckers, like, you watch, you watch the movie, what's it called? Uh, Blood Diamond, I believe it's called. And I'm not saying, even though it's nothing to do with diamonds, you can see for yourself, just, or look on YouTube. Of course, you can find something here about it, but, you know, what they do to these children and women, and it's fucked up. You know, motherfuckers are shot dead if they don't want to go in and mine these goddamn, you know, these caves and shit. And it's dangerous work that they're not giving any goddamn. Breathing instruments and nothing. They just got that motherfucker with a pick and a shovel, and that's it, you know. And that motherfucker from 6, 6 a.m. down to 6 at night. No food, no water, no nothing. 
this is crazy, man. You know, and Nintendo, a biggest, a big company like Nintendo, you know, was all that family oriented and all that shit. There's a backdrop. You know, I mean, when I tell you, like I said, you know, at the end of the day, like you know, like the same way you motherfuckers are voicing your opinion about this DRM and all that shit. You know, Nintendo was down for the gamer. That's why they don't have any third party support because you know they they said no to DRM. But you know, they for the gamer. Like, come on, this is like, come on, like, like. Like, I don't give a fuck who, whether it's Shokyo, Ultra, any of you motherfuckers, any of you big Nintendo fans out there. If, if this could have been Microsoft, and I've been appalled by this shit, this is some fucked up shit. This could have been Sony, whoever. Like, this is wrong. Something needs to be said. Something needs to be done. I, like I said, I'm a small pea in a, in a fucking pot of stew. But, you know, like I said, I do have a small voice, and I'm going to voice my opinion. Nintendo, this is dead wrong. I'm, how you said, I'm going to boycott Nintendo. You know, my dollar, you know what I mean, I, you know, like I said before, I got rid of my Wii U, you know what I mean, but like I said, you know, like I said, I was, I was playing, like I said, my wife has one still, uh, but she never took out the goddamn box, and I'm still planning on buying, you know, maybe even the Wonderful World of One One or even being the two, but I'm not buying anything from Nintendo until they, they can come up with a super duper console that's more powerful than the PS4 and the Xbox One combined. I won't buy it until they stop this shit right here, man. This is horrible. They can't say they don't know this company sent them over 400,000 emails. Like, come on, man. But anyway, as I always say, man, you guys hate, man. Hit them what he hurts, man. Don't support shit like this, man. Bang, bang. I ain't even, just, I ain't even laughing and joking, man, but I'm gonna say, ah! Nintendo, man, I'm done with y'all jokers, man. This is fucking disgusting, man. I'm off. I hopper.